The James Webb Space Telescope is hailed as the most significant global observatory in the realm of space science, thanks to its unparalleled capabilities. Unlike any instrument before it, the Webb Telescope stands alone in its mission to explore our solar system, and distant galaxies light years away. Its goal is not just to observe celestial bodies but to delve deep into the universe's fundamental structures, seeking to understand its complexities and our place within it. Recently, researchers directed the telescope's impressive gaze toward a star located 120 light years from Earth, leading to extraordinary discoveries. The telescope detected carbon-based molecules in the atmosphere of what could be an ocean-covered world, leaving the cosmic community astounded. This revelation raises intriguing questions about the possibility of habitable worlds at the farthest reaches of the universe. This finding marks the beginning of a journey to learn more about this exoplanet, captivating those eager to stay informed about significant advancements in space exploration. We encourage you to subscribe to our channel to stay updated on the latest cosmic revelations, and don't forget to share this video to spread the information. NASA's James Webb Space Telescope recently made a critical discovery regarding the exoplanet K218b, which has a mass approximately 8.6 times that of Earth. The telescope's advanced sensors identified carbon-based compounds, specifically methane and carbon dioxide, in K218b's atmosphere. This discovery supports the hypothesis that K218b may belong to a class of planets with conditions suitable for life. K218b orbits a cool, small star known as K218, located within the habitable zone, the region around a star where conditions might be right for liquid water and, by extension, life. Planets like K218b, which fall between Earth and Neptune in size, are rare and intriguing, especially since our solar system lacks similar planets in close proximity. The presence of carbon compounds in a hydrogen-rich atmosphere suggests that K218b might be capable of supporting life or at least conditions conducive to it. Early observations even hinted at the presence of dimethyl sulfide, a compound produced solely by biological processes on Earth. If confirmed, this would be a significant indicator of potential life. However, more robust evidence is needed to validate this claim, and future observations using the Webb Telescope are expected to provide further clarity. A researcher from the University of Cambridge noted that while K218 lies within the habitable zone and contains carbon compounds, this does not guarantee it can support life. Its size, with a radius 2.6 times that of Earth, suggests it may have a high-pressure icy mantle similar to Neptune's structure. This implies that while K218b has a hydrogen-rich atmosphere and an ocean-covered surface, the conditions within these oceans may be too extreme for life. Despite these challenges, researchers have captured the most detailed atmospheric spectrum ever obtained for a habitable sub-Neptune, allowing them to determine the molecular makeup of its atmosphere with remarkable accuracy. K218b is classified as a transiting exoplanet, meaning its brightness diminishes when it crosses in front of its host star. This dimming allows astronomers to study the composition of the atmosphere by examining the light that filters through it. Moving forward, the research team plans to use the Webb Telescope's mid-infrared spectrograph to further investigate K218b's atmosphere, aiming to confirm their preliminary findings. Their ultimate goal is to find evidence of subsurface activity on habitable exoplanets, which could significantly alter our understanding of the cosmos. In addition to its examination of K218b, the James Webb Space Telescope has made other important discoveries that enhance our understanding of the universe. Astronomers have identified intricate organic molecules in distant galaxy systems, marking the earliest known presence of such molecules in the universe. This discovery suggests that the universe was capable of producing complexity much earlier than previously anticipated, occurring less than 1.5 billion years after the Big Bang.
The JWST's ability to capture images and information from faraway galaxies offers a glimpse into the conditions that prevailed shortly after the Big Bang, helping researchers unravel the puzzle of cosmic generation, and the evolution of galaxies, stars, and planets. The study of exoplanets like K218b is particularly exciting because it provides opportunities for finding extraterrestrial life. By examining the atmospheres of distant planets, scientists can search for biomarkers, signs that life-sustaining processes may be occurring. These biomarkers could include various chemical compounds or patterns associated with biological activity. The Webb Telescope's cutting-edge technology also allows for exceptional observations of star-forming regions and stellar nurseries, which are essential for understanding how stars and planetary systems form and evolve. Moreover, the JWST is providing valuable information about the formation and evolution of our own Milky Way galaxy. By studying different parts of the galaxy, researchers can map its structure, understand the distribution of stars and interstellar matter, and gain insights into the processes that shaped its evolution. This information is crucial for understanding the broader context in which our solar system exists and piecing together the history of our universe. One particularly intriguing area of research involves the study of cosmic microwave background radiation, a faint glow that is a remnant of the Big Bang. Analyzing this radiation allows scientists to learn more about the conditions present shortly after the universe began. Data from the Webb Telescope can be complemented by observations from other missions, such as the Planck satellite, to provide a more complete picture of the universe's earliest stages. The technological advancements of the James Webb Space Telescope are profound. Its ability to observe phenomena across various frequencies, compared to previous telescopes that focused on specific aspects, gives it a significant advantage. Webb's instruments cover a wide range of the electromagnetic spectrum, from ultraviolet to mid-infrared, enabling researchers to study different cosmic processes in greater detail. Beyond its scientific contributions, the telescope plays a vital role in inspiring the next generation of scientists and astronomers. By capturing stunning images of distant galaxies, nebulae, and other celestial phenomena, it sparks curiosity and wonder, encouraging students and young researchers to pursue their passions in science and engineering. Furthermore, the collaborative nature of the Webb mission highlights the importance of international cooperation in space exploration. This project is a partnership between NASA, the European Space Agency, ESA, and the Canadian Space Agency, CSA, showcasing a global commitment to advancing human knowledge and exploring the universe. As technology continues to advance, future space missions and telescopes will build upon the foundation laid by the Webb Telescope. These missions may include even more powerful observatories or specialized instruments designed to probe specific aspects of the cosmos. Each new mission will contribute to the ongoing effort to understand the universe and our place within it. In summary, the James Webb Space Telescope represents a remarkable leap forward in our ability to investigate and comprehend the cosmos. Its groundbreaking discoveries, from the study of distant exoplanets to early galaxy observations, are reshaping our understanding of cosmic phenomena, and providing new insights into the fundamental processes that govern the universe. As we continue to push the boundaries of space exploration, the Webb Telescope will undoubtedly play a crucial role in uncovering the mysteries of the universe and inspiring future generations of researchers and explorers.